Hello everybody, thank you guys for tuning in to today's uh, tutorial. Uh, I'm Austin Torma, also known as Jar Customs, and today we're going to be knocking out a pair of boxing gloves. Uh, first step in doing this is we're going to uh, prepare the leather just like sneakers with our uh, Angelus Leather Prepare and Deglazer. If you don't prep it, the paint will not adhere to the surface. You know, in order to complete an artwork like such, you gotta prep the surface. If you don't prep it, the paint's just gonna chip, peel off easily. So if you prep it as much as you can, it's gonna, gonna make the custom durable as long as possible. All right, so now that we're done taping and prepping the surface, we are finally gonna get into painting. We're gonna use a uh, light gray first, and then we're gonna put some too thin in there. Yeah, we're working our way up to the white now. So it's, it's we did the light gray, but now it's like a lighter gray. So after this, we're gonna get into the white. Today we're doing like a Simpsons theme on these boxing gloves. So first, we're gonna just use a light blue. And then we're gonna go flat white. We're gonna just do a little blue. You wanna do light, light coats of it. You don't wanna do a big blob of the paint. The lighter the coat's the better. What I use for uh, stencils is I have my own uh, stencil maker at home. It's a, a Cricut Explorer uh, 2, I believe. And then with the transfer paper, you don't want to peel horizontally. You want to peel it off at more of an angle. Do light coats of this. You don't want to do a, a big blob of paint. Give it much a much better finish. All right. So now we're gonna make that Simpson yellow. And uh, what I like to use is like a 40% of maize and then 60% uh, of yellow. So next I'm going to make my own stencil and by doing that I'm going to use a masking tape. There's other ways you can do it but this is the way I prefer to do it so let me show you guys. So this is my sketch I did before I came here to Angeles. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to lay a masking tape down and I'm going to trace it over with a pencil and then cut it out with an exacto knife.
So I'm gonna do a base coat of Homer and white, and then after that, I'm gonna freehand the rest. And now next that we have to do is just lay it down with some matte finisher and we'll call it a day. I had a fun time doing this project. Painting with Angelus Bram uh, shows that you can paint on any leather material. It doesn't matter if it's boxing gloves, shoes, or etc. You guys can find me at Jar Customs on all social medias. And uh, I'll see you guys next time, hopefully. So, serving up soul, we're out.